teams today. The disadvantage, Alan, is that they don't play together very often. The positive, of course, is they are the country's very best players. They are indeed, and we have got some quality players to enjoy out there today, but uh, as you say, not all of them have played together too often, so there might be a slight lack of understanding at times. We do talk a lot, Alan, about footballers who are expected to win. I don't think there are any more pressured footballers in any club or any other country than those who play for Brazil. If you don't win any game, you're branded a failure. Yeah, and that's what makes their achievements all the more laudable. They seem able most of the time to be able to handle that pressure. This is the way Brazil are going into this game. Marcelo starts with Dani Alves in the full-back positions. Paulinho plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. And this is the team news for Spain today. David De Gea starts in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Piquet in central defence. David Silva plays with Vitolo on the flanks. Diego Costa is the lone striker today. Spain have started the game. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Koke, able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Marcelo. Here's Casimiro. Neymar. Now Casimiro. Renato Augusto. Now Dani Alves. Here's Casimiro. One or two tackles early on. He's given the free kick here. He's going to get his message across the ref. Sliding in and uh, taking his part in the game into uh, uh, a dangerous territory, really. Well, it is. He saw the ball and he thought he could win it, but just as fraction off. Today's main matchup, I think, you would say, is Neymar against David Silva. Neymar, he is a terrific finisher. He to take the lead. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Supported there as he can head it on to someone who's waiting to receive it. Now Danny Alves moving forward with some danger to the opposition. Now they're here. And it's with Vitolo. Here's a Vitolo. Iniesta. Diego Costa. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Marcelo. Silva. Koke. Diego Costa. Koke. He stopped the opposition, gets the ball out of harm's way. Renato Augusto. And he's timed his break, Coutinho on side. Coutinho in really for what seemed a certain opening goal. Oh dear, oh dear, I think it's one of those that might play on his mind now for the rest of the match. Silva, 
They've got numbers in this attack, and it looks dangerous. Deflected out for a throw. Now he's looking for support. Koke. Now with Danny Carvajal. Koke. And they've cut it out. Paulinho. Well, suddenly they could be on the... The break is definitely on. And a goal! He really fancied him to score, but the goalkeeper kept his beliefs and kept him out. Yeah, I mean, he'd be asking where his defenders were, but come at the hour, he stepped up there, didn't he, the keeper? That's a fine shot, and even better save. He's a long way out, and sometimes they can catch keepers by surprise, but he was on his toes. Neymar's corner. Miranda! That is a terrific header. Unlucky, it's just off target. They generated some power on it, and the keeper wasn't getting there. Iniesta. Marcelo. Paulinho. Renato Augusto. It's Marquinhos. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Promising build-up until that challenge. Roberto Firmino. Neymar. Out to Neymar. Out on the flank. Neymar! Off the bar. Back into play. Goalkeepers love to be busy, and he's certainly busy at the moment. The frame of the goal helping him out. And now at least he can settle his team down and get the ball upfield. Well, if you hit the post or bar, you've not hit the target. Although they did in the second one, it was too easy for the keeper. And now Iniesta. It's a good attack, this by Spain. Koke. Well, here comes the support. Played the ball. And now Iniesta. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. Roberto Firmino. Neymar. Well, they're in a good position here. David De Gea with the save, a magnificent save. Brazil have a corner. Goalkeeper rising to the occasion, literally. Yeah, because it was sweetly struck, and you do have to pay attention to those. Neymar on the set piece, the corner. Oh, that's good defending. Miranda, Renato Augusto, Paulinho, here's Casemiro, Marcelo, very skilled, these passes may look it. To take the lead, and they've scored! It's got to go down, I think, as one of the goals of the season, because it wasn't just about the finish, it was that marvellous build-up play, so many players involved in it. I think they might have thought against Brazil that they get to half-time, but Brazil, you can never write them off. Only a few seconds left, and they've made the most of those few seconds. Oh, they've just got to compose themselves in the dressing room and try and come back at this Brazil team. Not easy. In 
front are Brazil. PK. So it's 1 0 here as the half time whistle goes. Coutinho has been outstanding in this first half. Yeah, and what a good time to score that was. Uh, put his side in the lead. period now to start with Brazil leading at the halfway point in the match now Casimiro Roberto Firmino that's good movement forward here the shot's on simple save for David De Gea Silva Unlike him, really, to play the ball straight to the opposition. Roberto Firmino. He's got his shot off now. Superb from De Gea. With this goal advantage, they've now got a corner. In from Neymar, and they get it away. Iniesta. Now it's back with Brazil. Paulinho. Renato Augusto. And turned away by the goalkeeper spectacularly. Iniesta. Here's Danny Alves. And the attacking play coming from Brazil. Chance for the cross. Past his man. And shoots! Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely. And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. Two for him on the day, and two very well-taken goals. And here is another angle on that goal. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. Sergio Busquets. It's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Able to ease the pressure by that interception. Paulinho getting forward well as a team now. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. Renato Augusto. Miranda. Paulinho. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Iniesta. Roberto Firmino. Renato Augusto. Marcelo. Coming on strong and looking to play their way through now. Coutinho. 
Renato Augusto. Marcelo. Roberto Firmino. And Brazil going for goal. Corner for Brazil. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. going well for the home players and their supporters the away players finding it hard in the match and the fans now getting very frustrated they think that there is some jiggery pokery going on here well it's uh, predictable I suppose that maybe even the home fans are a little bit unhappy they want to see their team go for one or two more goals but that might be a bit of a reckless thing to do now Silva and they're trying to dispossess him on the move and able to cut out the pass. Iniesta. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. And it's a good attack missed by Spain. Made the challenge well. Go straight through to the goalkeeper, that's not what he had in mind. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Clever pass, Roberto Firmino responsible for that. Casimiro. Good work from the keeper. Now that will be a corner. There'll be some changes for Spain. Neymar's corner. Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. Shots on! Wonderful finish! Another late goal to emphasise the gulf between the two sides today. Yeah, and it's been that type of match. I think everybody out there, the strikers particularly, want to increase the goal tallies, and they've done it. Well, we're in the last few minutes now, and the die has been cast in this game, really. Referee's had a good look and decided on what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Aspas. And there's the last blast on the whistle today. I can't recall seeing such a one-sided match, Alan, for a long time. No, one team turned up, the other one stayed in the dressing room, I think. It was incredible to watch. It was absolutely extraordinary, exceptional, elegant, excellent. Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here won the match for his team. But as for him... I think if he'd have been in better form today, we might have had a different result. But the fact is, he was below par, as was his team. Well, suddenly they could be on the cap. The break is definitely on. And a goal! On the flank. Neymar!
they're in a good position here. David De Gea with the save, a magnificent save. Very skilled. These passes may look easy. To take the lead. He's got his shot off now. Superb from De Gea. Past his man. And shoots! Casimiro. Good work from the keeper. Neymar's corner. Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. Shot on! Wonderful finish!